Oh no, I'm about to lose my coverage. No! We've beamed down to a planet of strange men in swaddling clothes. What's your reading, Chekhov? I'm Sulu! Whoa, that thing came out of nowhere. Hey, Dad, I need you to sign this permission slip. They're teaching sex education at school. Hmm. Could you give us a moment, Steve? Ah! How about when that werewolf puked up that guy's arm? Sure, it was scary, but it's just a movie. And, and not even a real movie. It was shot in Canada. Oh, cool! A germ warfare booth! No way, mister! I don't want you coming home with anthrax like last year. Ah, oh, Mom! Quit coddling the boy. Just sprinkle a little Cipro on his hot dog. He'll be fine. Come on, sweetheart. Don't be afraid. Ah, you're worthless. Clear! <laughs> what have we here? Secret White House bunker? Secret Halliburton bunker? Satan? This is Dick Cheney's Blackberry. Some of the guys at school say if you have urges, you can handle them yourself. Okay, I'll just place a thin strip of wood across my unprotected lap. Now take that red-hot poker and drive it on home, hard as you can. Wait! The good hobbyist always thinks about safety first. Now let her rip. I'm sorry that 30 years ago you got some lousy advice about sex that screwed you up. But I cannot let you do the same thing to our son. I'm not screwing him up. Yeah, Mom, I know my body is filthy. Sun was in your eyes. Quinn took that one. You weren't ready yet. You weren't ready yet. You weren't ready yet. Good job, son. Take your base. Unfortunately, the game's been rained out. Oh, no. Yeah, I know. God, I'm crushed. You know, we could still do something together. We sure could. Well, goodbye. I'm stranded in the middle of the desert with no food, no water. But at least I finally get to see Angelina Jolie's sweet supple. No! Hey, son. Don't sun me, baby snatcher. Something on your mind, champ? Steve, what are you doing? Something we've both wanted to do for years, sis. Oh my god, everything that happens from this point on is just gravy. So now I was a published writer, but my life had become boring. As boring as a bad metaphor, or a simile. Whatever, I'm not a writer. They? Who's they? The smut-peddling flag burners or the god-killing tree-huggers? Tree-huggers, I think. Um, everything, I guess. I talk a big game, but I actually know very little about sex. Well, you don't have to worry about it because you're not having it. That's it! Barry stopped taking his meds! He's unretarded! Don't take that! It turns you into one of them! Thanks, but if you touch me again, I'll cut your nipples off. Hey, there's a reason I'm here. My family's in danger. I gotta get home. So, this family of yours, do they, uh... I don't know, have nipples? Roger, I am sick of sharing the house with all these foster kids. This is over! Samantha! Megan! Steve, meet your new personal assistants. Ladies, take a memo. Boing! Sincerely, Steve Smith. Dictated, but not read. I think he's dangerous. He told me he's been strangling cats for years. I did not! He's just... Look out! He's got a gun! Damn your experimental steroids! It's okay, son. You're experiencing a perfectly natural side effect called roid rage. Oh, I'm experiencing a side effect, all right. I have boobs! Oh, my God! I know. Talk about a butter face. Oh, man. Cheney's Blackberry. Here, here, call India. It's ringing. It's got one of those funny rings that goes... Doot, doot. Savages. Hello? India? Yeah, it's Pakistan. You know that nuclear peace treaty you sent over? Yeah, well, well listen to this. Yeah! Yeah, that's me wiping my butt with it. Oh, 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 it is on! Oh, 
Meet me at the border at 3 o'clock. Oh, and FYI, I'm punching a cow right now. That, that'll drive him crazy. But I think you're doing an amazing job. No one likes a suck-up, Terry. Dad, there you are. Uh, of, of, of course I'm here. Where, where would I be? Alone, touching myself? Yeah, right. Only perverts and Democrats do that. Gretchen, ready to party? I brought us a sixer of insure. Oh, oh, ju just a minute. Hey, baby. You're early. I was so excited I couldn't keep away. That's funny. My friend Snot has a cut-off Wrangler jean vest just like that. How? How could you? Handsome, you've got to understand. I don't have long for this world. Monogamy is for girls in their 60s. Don't try to apologize. From now on, there is a sign on our love, and that sign reads, Do not resuscitate. <laughs> Let's just make sure we never let a woman come between us again. Oh, agreed. <laughs> and that's how I lost a testicle. Wow, Grandpa. I thought I heard every story there was about Betty Davis. That's Dan Weber. Sorry, Weber. You're going away for a long time, so pack your baggins. Dad, I know people here. Mom, Dad, you better come in here. Um, um, okay, okay, uh, uh dead, uh, lifeless, uh, Lindsay Lohan's eyes! My childhood died on July 18th, 2003, the day Kobe Bean Bryant was charged with sexual assault. Lord, please, send me some water, or food, or... Angelina Jolie. Angelina Jolie's fine. I guess I sort of got... Why was he even in Colorado in the first place? Black man don't go to Colorado. Sweetie, you don't need popcorn. I made you some muffins. Cool. Your muffins are the best. I can sell them to my friends and buy some popcorn. Want to play Rebuild Iraq? I'm, I'm Halliburton. Halliburton. I called it. I'm Halliburton. How much for the woman? Woman? Oh, no. That's just Raj... Sold! <laughs> So, now that you know they're not your real parents, are you gonna call them Stan and Francine? No, I'm gonna call them Mom and Dad. I'm still their son. Oh, Stan, calm down. As far as I'm concerned, we only have one child. It's like someone left the other one on our doorstep. <gasps> oh! <laughs> ah, I just love it when crap lines up like that. You guys really think I'm a werewolf? Well, we can't take any chances. There's a full moon tonight. Wait a minute. I understand the rope, but what's the deal with the gag and kimono? I don't know, but I walked in on my parents once, and they were using all three. But there's no way I'm a... Oh, oh, oh. You like that, don't you, bitch? That's what my mom says to my dad. Oh, my God, the heat is killing me. I just need air for a second. Oh... Uh, Steve, right? Uh, yeah? Killer jugs. Oh, uh, thanks, Vince Chung. No prob. Up top. Blah! Oh, yeah! Sir, um, where are we? Well, we ain't at a dentist in Tucson trying to convince the waitress it's our birthday. We're on an oil rig in the Atlantic. Try to escape and you'll be met with deadly sharks and sniper fire. Do as you're told and you'll find this a very safe environment. You can do this, Gary. Your time is now. All right, maggots to the barracks! All right, Barry, the jig is up. Steve, you're a jockey. Had to play identity theft to get home. Had to do a lot of things you taught me to get home. Look who's here. Steve, want me to teach you some dolphin chatter? You've already taught me how to speak dolphin. All they ever want to talk about is mackerel. Nonsense. The dolphins are great. <laughs> Ah, 
I have no idea what this is. But I'm too tired to question it. Let's get you a little fresh air. <sighs> Mr. Madsen? I'm Tom, your son. Oh my god. Tommy, is it really you? Jane, come quick! Mama? Thomas, you are alive! All these years, we never gave up hope. Gotcha! <gasps> Those aren't your parents! That's for taking my cookie! What? Remember? You snooze, you lose! You... you put me through all this j just because I ate your cookie? Hey, hey, how was the party? They gave me and Snot swirlies, threw Toshi in the trash, and used Barry's fat folds to open their beers. I'm gonna make a necklace. You know, before we fire off your dad's mortar, maybe we should read the instruction manual. Hey, if a five-year-old Palestinian can figure it out, so can I. Water in the hole! <laughs> Friends, I am a werewolf. I've taken a life, and I'm sure I will again. Therefore, you must use this silver bullet to kill me. My only regret is I'll never know the sweet, silky tingle of real boob. I can't let you go out like this. Here. Are you? Are you sure? Because I won't lie, I, I have thought of it. Mind if I call you Jennifer? Jennifer. Miss Piggy. Come on, coach. I didn't pay you to not play my son. Scared he's gonna be too good. Uh, 30 years of smoking and I'm still alive. Smith, you're in. Hear that? This is your chance. Yay, this is my chance. Sorry about my unusually thick tongue. He forgot to stretch, that's all. <laughs> Just uh, needs to walk it off. <coughs> Thirsty much. <laughs> Dude, did you just hear what Vince Chung said? Yeah, he's so cool and popular, you forget he's Asian. <laughs> when a man and a woman are in love or very drunk, they or the man can balance on his elbows and push off with his feet. Which is why you should always have a towel handy to... Now, moving on to toys. Stan, that's enough for one day. Right, Steve? <laughs> I'm gonna miss him. Uh, me too. I promised God that if I beat this thing, I'd help save these poor kids from you. <gasps> Judas! Come on, children, we're taking you far away from this man. Hooray! We're ready to go home! Oh, we don't have a home! Uh, uh, I let you kiss each other while I watched, and this is how you repay me? Hey, that's my dad's Tara Reed collector's plate. You can't touch that. You know how much that'll be worth in a few months when she's dead? You gonna use your diaper? I'm kind of floating over here. Sure, let me just. <laughs> Sorry, Akupado. Hurry up, that's the fifth pair you've tried on. I wanna see how my boy goods look in yellow. Oh, yeah. Sold and. Sold. I'm gonna wear these out. Well, that's an easy choice. Did the book make me rich and popular? Yeah. Did it all go to my head? Oh, yeah. Did I start talking like Robert Evans? You bet your ass I did. Did I even know who Robert Evans was? Not by a long shot. One for Mr. Mouse, cheese detective? Dude, we're going to the soiling. The werewolf movie's so scary, it makes you mess your pants. Come on, no movie's that scary. One for the soiling. Okay, here's your diaper. Changing tables are by the butter dispenser. 
<laughs> that is refreshing. I'm glad you guys talked me into taking a dip. Aren't you coming in? Nah, it looks like the water's kind of cold. But why don't you show us how Flipper swims backwards again? Oh, okay. Gentlemen, I made out with a chick. She's an older woman. Yeah? How old? She's 80. <laughs> how come all the women are dressed like ninjas? Good morn, mateys. Today, Captain Monty sails his fair vessel with precious cargo. Child prodigy and most likely ninth incarnation of the Buddha, Steve Smith. I had rooms filled with the finest antiquities. Rooms devoted to girl-on-girl -girl action. Scintillating. Barry, Toshi, Snot, you're my best friends. You're all worthy of killing me, but only one of you can. I should do it. My parents couldn't afford a bar mitzvah, and I need a rite of passage. It's Steve! Dude, it's us, your friends! Remember? We came out here to kill you? Ombre, what's the matter? It's just, I kinda missed my family. Brosicle, I'm your family now, and this dude is never, ever gonna leave you. Never. Spike Baltar's dead in your pool. You're finished. I'm out of here. An S wants to C-L-T-D-F-H-C. Cut loose the dead weight from his coattails. There should be a W in there. Get in the trunk, Barry. Oh, I wish I could get that guy back. I'd like to dress up like a girl and make him have sex with me. Then say, ha! I'm not a girl! You just had sex with a boy who hates you! Ha <laughs> ha! Now that the seeds of mistrust are sprouting, we must harvest them. Hello? Miss Lawrence, just a few questions for a fitness survey. Uh, where do you typically work out? At the gym. Good. And where is it located? About three miles north of here. After you work out, how do you relax? I get a massage. And when your car is not in drive, it's in... Park. And if you're from Brazil, you're... You're Brazilian. Look, is this a crank call? Hold, please. I can't wait around. I'm leaving to meet... Did you get it? Got it. Please leave a message. Hello? Jim. Who's Jim? I can't wait to massage your Brazilian crank. Meet me at three at the... <laughs> Of the park. I'm leaving Miles. She must have done my number by mistake. She's cheating on me. <laughs> <laughs> and there's Miles. He thinks Trudy's meeting Brazilian Jim here. And there's Trudy. She thinks Miles is meeting Earring Girl. They'll break up with each other, then we'll swoop in and comfort them. I'm sick of your lies! Where's that Brazilian douchebag? You're the liar! Where's your whore? I really think Miles and I have a future. Yeah, there's something about Trudy's soul that warms me. Ugh. His face! Oh Her bod! I'm out. Yeah, me too. Your antipsychotic vitamin is in one of these glasses. You choose which one, then we both drink. Delightful. Careful, Steve. He's as mad as he is fat. I'll just make my decision based upon what I know about you. You escaped the work camp, so I know you're cunning. I also know you're shy, far-sighted, grumpy in the morning. I know you've seen the Princess Bride. You're stalling. And I knew you were going to say that. I know you're a handful at boy-girl parties, your name backwards is Nevitz, and your aim at the urinal is, shall we say, less than accurate? Are you gonna choose a glass? Yes, I choose this one! Thanks for driving me home, Mr. Smith. We're going faster than people. Quiet, fatty, fat, fat, fatty! Sorry we sent you to work camp, son. Barry really pulled one over on us. How'd you know he'd pick the right glass? I put vitamins in both. I found this on the floor. 